Hey guys, it's me, Kendra one here once again with another vehicle review for you guys. This is on my LEGO World War II German Utility Truck. So it can also be a true carrier truck, but let's get started. First I'll give you a 360 degree view of it. Alrighty, there's that, um, part. So now, um, now let's move on to the features. The first feature that's pretty obvious is that it has an opening bed, sort of, or like a little opening thing, like sort of like a, um, a pickup truck, sort of. Um, yeah. Then we have the back with the license plate, two grill pieces, and the lights. And then, right here, there are six wheels. Um, then, that's that. Um, then right here you have two, um, tools. That's what I called it, a utility truck. Um, yeah, and there's sort of the interior. Nothing really special about it, um, but, yeah. Um, now the front, got two grill pieces, a flat piece, and two headlights. Then, right here, just the engine piece, or like the engine opener. Next is the cab, or, yeah, cab, pretty much. Um, there, there's armored windows, because you don't want the guy inside to get shot by any fire. And then this opens really easily. Um, then inside, sort of a snug layout. Um, right, there's the emergency brake. Um, I have to give credit to Patty Daddy for that, because, um, he used it in one of his vehicle, um, how-tos, so check him out. Um, then the steering wheel, right blue steering wheel, pretty common. Yeah, that was pretty common in World War II. Um, then you have the shifter, the stick shift. Um, and, yeah. Um, where did it go? Okay, there. And then, oh yeah, on the back it ha also has back view ports. Little round pieces like that. And, yeah. Um, that's all I pretty much have for... This vehicle review is pretty simpler, it's pretty simple. Oh, it can also hold a max of six minifigures. One in the cab and five in the back. So, yeah guys, thank you for watching. Um, rate, comment, subscribe, and thank you for your previous support on my past vehicle review. See ya.